spooky spirits and welcome back i am so excited to get back into this series goosebumps 2023 today we are doing episodes five six and seven i am so hyped i really liked the previous episodes there were a couple ones that i wasn't as crazy about but they were all pretty fun um and nostalgic and i'm really excited because today it looks like we are getting into episodes that are readers beware not as living dummy which i'm most excited for and then Give Yourself Goosebumps, which the only one I know of a notable title from the actual Goosebumps series is Night of the Living Dummy. So I don't know what else these other ones are coming up with. I don't know what they have to do with the series or what they have to do with the story. But I'm excited. I'm hyped. I hope you guys are too. I hope you're enjoying the content. We still got a lot of spooks coming our way. So sit back, grab a snack, and enjoy my first time watching Goosebumps from 2023, episodes 5, 6, and 7. So far, I have to say the series, though weak in some areas, is surprising me. Take your meds, get some rest, and oh, I'll shit, be back right. with your son before you know it. She's still in the freaking, she's in the psych ward now. Because they, last episode, they put Nora in the freaking psych ward. Oh my gosh. Fine. She's not crazy. And what meds are you even giving her? Because she's taking meds that aren't doing anything for her. Bro, you might as well just pretend you took those pills and spit them out. They're not doing anything for you. Can you please stop doing that? Who the fuck is doing that? Stop. Ew! I want him. Who? Slappy? Do we have Slappy? I guess I don't- he wants him back, who is what I can assume is Slappy, but what did they do to Slappy? Because it's something from their past that they did to him. Oh. Well, not to worry. We can always go get more if we need it, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, you okay? Yeah, I'm still a star from the, like, you know, thing. Oh, when you smashed my car. Still gotta call my insurance company. Yeah. Premiums, right? What is that? I don't know. I'm really glad that it's you. Oh. So glad that it's you that's here. Do you feel that way too? Sure. Yeah, that makes sense. I mean, I'm glad I'm here with you too. Oh. Ooh, well, at least it can't get any more awkward. Well, let's give it time. This is uh, weird. Does anybody want some wine? Yeah. A lot, please. Mark, you take this? No, Dad, I'm in high school. Uh, I'll drink. Aw. Uh, it's just it's in the old guidance counselor class. Yeah, I was gonna say, good job, okay. you guys. Can we talk about this? The other parents like you asked, so I can't get into it right now. There's no that I need to take care of first. I'm just no. curious. Should I go? No. Yes. Should I go? <laughs> Lucas. You cannot possibly comprehend how complicated this is. Yes, I can. Believe me, I can. Okay, well, I can't talk about it right now. You can yeah. keep sounding back. I can be honestly though, I get where she's coming from, where it's like the dad is literally within the other room, but still like can we at least give some assurance we're going to talk about it? The uh, cork broke off in the bottle. I was trying to get it out. What are you talking about? Oh, nothing. As usual. Can I be excused? Oh my gosh, girl. We can't shut down like that, though. We're never going to get anywhere. Going back to this. Lucas is the only one who's eating. <laughs> I got nothing. And it brings it out of her. Fine. Good. Damn. Oh, the cork has been broken. Oh, really? She was a bitch, Fine. dude. Oh, she wasn't. She was the worst. the worst. Yeah. No, no, that. The girl gave us nothing. I, literally, Allison wasn't even interesting enough to be the worst. Hmm. Well, she was. This breakup was inevitable. The mother yet? I was planning on telling her when she gets here. But you know that Lucas is staying in her house right now, right? Right. You don't think I got, like, anything? No, dude, they'd be step siblings. Like, no. Who? 
No. No, I think Luke is, is straightforward. I feel like you started being really distant when I started high school. Like, you were just waiting for me to grow up so you can finally be free. Aww. Yeah, these years I take as teenagers are pretty short. <laughs> Lucas, <laughs> shut up! Oh, no! <clears throat> so, is this the way to Jericho? Yeah, it's just, uh, it's a way. It's the, uh, it's the long way. Okay. I wanted to show you something first. <sighs> okay, are these two giving me energy as far as, like, they like each other? Because I, I really, there's, like, step, they're going to be step siblings. Oh, so, like, calm down. That's a cute little jungle gym. It's actually the spot where I've broken every bone in my body. Oh, wow. Really? But it, oh. it kind of sounded cooler. Like that. Yeah. It was really just like the, the six in like my left hand. Oh damn. Still though. So uh, why is it that you picked me here? I guess I just want you to know that like even when it feels like totally hopeless and you're hurting, you know, stuff gets better. Like I was kind of like rambling and I'm just like, I, I don't I like really this. Like I'm not going to kiss you because it's no. Feels no, we are literally, our parents are literally dating. Like, fucking weird. No. Oh my god, no. Like, Nothing. Don't trust anyone and then nothing. Yeah, and then she gave me this excuse about not wanting to say the wrong thing and then. But you couldn't have just, like, I don't know, grabbed her by what I'm assuming is a very strange blouse and, like, made her tell you what was <laughs> going on. James. She did say yes, so maybe later she'll tell us something. But that's not really helpful I don't now. Know, I'm sorry. This is just my mom. She's extremely good at disappointing me and never answering any of my needs. I understand. I mean, my mom sucks too. I really dreamt about murdering her in her sleep. Holy sh... Isabella. What I had the last time. Uh, yeah, I'll take tea. No. So you got some serious rage inside you. I yeah, do. it's scary. You know, and my therapist tells me the same thing. I told you I saw you. And I didn't think you were crazy. I told the police that you saw John and Emma. I told her they told the truth. I told it Larson and Ben and Victoria. And now I'm in here. Yeah. And I smell Biddle again. You saw Biddle in here? Yes. He asked me where he is. He said he wants me back. Who's he though? I I feel like it's Slappy, but what did they do to Slappy? I thought I saw it too. Yeah. He's looking. Uh, hello. Hi, Mr. Rat. The hell is that? Sarah, right? Your dad said she went to school here. Yeah. Why do you ask? Oh no, just because I was cleaning out my basement the other day and found the scrapbook. So. Scrapbook. Biddle stay here. Yeah, so I thought maybe you could show it to your mom. Just because uh, there are photos of her from high school in there. And I just thought she'd get it. Dude, this is a weird fucking conversation. Okay. Okay, cool. I'll see you later. He just walks up to you and hands you a book that has pictures of your mom in it from when she was in high school and you don't have any questions. You coming? Photo club? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> they were friends. God, that's so cute. No, girl, we were having answers. Been staring off into space. Are you on drugs? <laughs> you on drugs? In the dark room. Okay, it's gonna show her. Oh, this is amazing. Did you make that? Oh, um, yeah. It's like another hobby, I guess. Cool. This is really cool. These are a lot of my favorite things. Um. I don't know. Maybe that doesn't make any sense. That makes sense. So he was like artsy. On stage in the ordinary. Who said that? You. <laughs> Look, Aww. I know you said no, but I really think that you should come here with my friends this weekend. 
You're cooler than you think. Maybe. That's kind of yeah, nice, but I feel yeah. like something's gonna happen. Maybe. This is gonna be. Just make sure it's not that one. That he's looking for a thing. Exactly why she needs to be helped. Oh my gosh. Do you believe her? No. Of course I don't. But this is dangerous, Sarah. The lives we build. Her life too. It all goes away if she can't keep it together. What the hell are we hiding? Did you guys do something that was like that detrimental? Okay. The way that it works is that if I'm in the location that the page is about, I see the footprints. I see the tracks. The footprints. So all the information that we need is in the scrapbook. The brat gave you. Do you not think that it's a little weird that all of this started happening the same exact time that brat moved into the Biddle house? About what? Like what? What's going on with you? I think it's time to hurt you. Oh, hurt you? Uh, what does that mean? Did someone threaten you? Yes. Who? No, I, I can't explain it. I gotta go, okay? What, girl? My friend's waiting for me. He's, He's telling you something that's really important. Later. What are you doing, Don't Carol? Don't leave me. Let go of my arm! Dara! Dara! You can't go either, Marco. I'm not gonna let you leave me. Mm, girl! What did we say was gonna happen? What's going on? Marco, come on, wake up! Marco! I was, uh. I was visiting Morris. Aww. Why were you visiting Morris? Because they're together. Yeah, we should probably talk. Oh, girl, we don't have time for this. So you're sleeping with Nora. We don't have time for this. I mean, I was using vaguer language, but well. What's more vague than sleeping I with? We were on a, a trial separation. We were. Yeah. We are separated. I thought we were gonna at least have a talk before a verdict? I thought the separation was the verdict. Really? See, we did not communicate well. We didn't do good that we didn't do that well. I wanted you guys to come with me. Why didn't we had all we? just moved together? None of this would be happening. So what? I would just leave my job and my pension and career and we would just pull our child out of high school and away from all the friends that she's known her whole life. Great plan. I told yeah. you that I needed to leave. Why? I couldn't stay here anymore. But you didn't tell me why. I can't tell you why. It doesn't matter. You know one love. They just need to listen to us. Yeah, no shit. But the medication you give them will take over your whole life for the rest of them. Yeah, I know. If you want to get out of here, you have to stop taking the pills and stop talking to me. They don't understand. They don't. They don't get it. I believe you. Nope. But I do. So we need to we need to protect our kids. Drama kids. <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> Gosh. <laughs> now, where did you even get a dolly? Yeah, we need to split up the seating. We can't just have her lay like that. doing are they breaking into his house why he's showing her the truth who are they who's there he's showing her the truth who is it who wait a second it? are they the reason he died are they the reason he died They're your Who parents. Are Who are they? Stay away from me. Oh shit. So 
they killed him, basically. I mean, it all was in, in an accident for him, but, like, they did it. But those people were them, were your parents. And they stole Slappy. Why? We have to get him out. Yeah, what the fuck? He's gone. Harold's gone. What the fuck? I told you. You didn't believe me. Not now, Nora. Now what? Do you call someone? No. Dead, okay, doesn't mean we have to ruin our lives too. You all jail. Okay, grab the key. What did you steal this for? Why did you even what was murder worth stealing a case with a dummy in it? Uh, yes, our parents have hidden things, but they wouldn't just kill someone. They did though, yeah, you just, just watched it. Just did. Now Margo's right. There's gotta be way more to this story. Like, what the hell was in that case? You guys want to know what's in the case? Uh, no. Come inside. No, thank you. you. No, thank you. I don't want to. Say all about it. I don't want to. Thank you. Hey, Mr. Brad. Yeah? How do you have that case? Oh, I I'll explain everything. Just, just sit down. I don't trust this, though, because he had that Duke James cool. bring him that box. So he he's the guy who wants the that. I, I have the cocoa powder. <laughs> no, I, We're fine. Can we just get on with it? Okay, sure. Um, all right. <clears throat> so it all started with my great-grandfather in 1925. Wait, how long is this story? Yeah. Can you just... Okay, so long again. The story begins with my great-grandfather in 1925. I need a new act, but not just the regular old tricks. I need the expensive stuff, okay. the stuff you sell to the big boys. Is the big games, now? okay. No, I gotta wait till the kid is, please. Oh. Gotta be something in here, though, isn't there? I don't think so. What about that case? Yourself. Yes, but have you invested? No. In this. Oh, that is an it's ugly ass plastic. doll. And look, it was embroidered right here with Sandy's little bed. A doll? We bought a doll? We need to get a real job. This is what I was meant to do. I know that. <sighs> Financial trouble, kid. Bath while we still have hot water. Milano, Loma. Ooh. Always loved slapping. So I'm so hyped. This is the episode I've been waiting for. And now, a round of applause for my new assistant, Slappy. Slappy. Thank you, thank you. Uh, I'm uh, excited to allay you. Sir, I can see your mouth moving. Okay, the wait, object is not. Slappy, I need you to pick a, a car. In there. See, he'll do so much better once Slappy fun. starts moving. I agree. <gasps> this man is a true muttonhead, a simpleton, a ninny, an ignorant flum diddly coot. <laughs> no, wait a minute. I'm not doing this. He he's doing this. The dummy's doing this already. Oh, oh I'm the dummy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Run with it. I mean, improv improvisation. You don't want to be a loser your whole life, do you? No, certainly not, but, but I, I don't... Enough. Finish your act. Please. Yeah, I was gonna say, just Trust play me. along. You're gonna make money I by a dummy. Family and you don't spend any time with us anymore. Oh, he made it big. Oh, Never shoot. But his family fell behind. I choose him. Why? I've been doing this for a long time, Ephraim. If you yeah. ever wanted to take the night off... Why would I want to take the night off? I, I'm just... looking down the road, Ephraim, in case things change. It's 
fucked up a family, didn't you? I was gonna say, and you have a fan or you had a family. He's going to ruin our plans. They're delivering it tonight. Deal Ew. with him. Practicing. Ephraim, use the spell. Donna. What the hell? Nini. Sonata. What the hell? Ugh! 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 Is he turning you into a dummy? Oh my god. Read it. I'll do. Then you're ready. It turns. What the hell? Yeah, no. We're not gonna murder a bunch of people. We're just not. Proud new owner of this lodge. Separate lodge okay. is needed to just yes, they're already inside as you requested. Uh, would you like me to hire someone to do the work for you? No, I don't want any help. In fact, I don't want anyone here at all. Okay, so he was well, trying to keep them anything, away. You just please don't hesitate to give a call. All righty. Okay, well that's pretty smart. Ever again. Wow. Someone will find me. So he put bricks. So I'm surprised Slappy didn't put up more of a fight. Uh, sorry, I'm just a little bit confused. Yeah, well, just let him keep talking. Yeah, if you listen to the story, you know, you might get there. Okay, just just Kids with the terribles and cell phones and YouTubes. It's like, uh, you don't focus. You, get, you can't focus on a really good story. I'm sorry it took so long to talk to you, Daryl. That's some brat left in the old family contact. Clearly. It wow. Took 10 years to track oh, and this is this this is his heir. Ah, I have some music kept very much to himself. He was a bit eccentric. Oh, uh, and this is our son, Harold. What? So he's very much like his what grandfather. Have you got in there? My pets. It it kind of is a pet. They're worms. Worms? <laughs> uh, you received our factory signed forms? We did. All the privileges need to resolve. We are now the full owners. Welcome to Port Lawrence. Okay. Not quite the big city it used to be. Ew, that's where they find the mask. Look at this. Wow. Yeah, these look a little bit rickety. No, they're yeah. actually they're kind of solid. Oh wow. Oh my gosh. Oh well, this this has potential. That's a big this basement. This is a hangout spot for you and your new friends. Yeah. Okay. Maybe some carpet, a boombox. What do you think? Well, I need to see who else is. Oh, I like the parents' optimism, though. Down here. I want my MTV. Right? Yeah, and heat lamp for the worms. You know, maybe now that we're in a new place, you could talk about getting a different pet. Do you need a golden retriever? Yeah, a doctor's one. Okay. Well, do worms even have brains? If there's brains, there's five parts and you purchase the golden retriever hat. Okay. Wow. Uh, why don't you uh, check out your room, okay, bud? Get the heck out of here. I promise you. We do not do something for money. Okay. Is it an invisibility cloak? Yes. It's no, okay. No, maybe for your birthday. Just open it. It's what a is Polaroid it? camera. Ooh. You, you, you put your, your film in right there, and then the picture just comes out instantly. Well, that's a fun one, too, because it folds up. I didn't know it folded up. I love them. I don't know what a Polaroid is. I just um, don't know how it's going to help me here. Cool. Two words. Photo club. So maybe it will lend you a hand in helping you with your new film. Okay. That not fun. Says who? Me, I just said it. Ha. I like him. Hey, Cheesy. <laughs> I like their relationship though. It seems so open. Hi. Is this the photo club? Yes. That's why there's a giant sign. Yeah. We take it pretty seriously. How long have you been doing photography? Not I've at all. I've been doing it for quite a while. How long? Like since the beginning of this past summer. Okay. Huh. Um, well, I have this camera. Yeah. And 
You gotta okay, give her no. more experience than that. Oh, okay. I'm wow. Kidding. Damn. I'm terrible. Oh my gosh, an SX-70? Is that vintage? Ooh. It's That's new. Sarah. It's charged more for it if it looks old. Can I? What? Look at the camera? Yeah. Oh, yeah, sure. Oh, he liked her. Could have at least had him say cheese okay. or something. I'm getting around here before, are you new? I just moved here. I'm Harold. No way. They're all too dark. I like the contrast. Who has all this weird stuff in your basement? I don't want my photos to look like everyone else's. Sometimes yeah. I just feel like I see the world differently, and I just want these to show that. That's a fun way to look at it. Look at all the stuff you want to fill up in fog, dude. <laughs> Wait, when did that happen? When you didn't load it into the camera correctly? You're the one who loaded it. I don't think so. You did. <laughs> Let's take it from all the inside. What? Hey, it's Elijah's birthday this weekend, so we're having a party at Ben's. You should come. Oh. No, thanks. Well, we yeah, I would be a little scared. Your friends are what? Cool. You're cool. I'm definitely not cool. Mm. Yeah, but not cool can be cool. Ben's a quarterback. Victoria is going to be valedictorian. Eliza's a cheerleader, and Nora is scary. Never talk. Oh. Everybody's so mean to Nora. Just come, Harold. It's just a party. It's like, I can show you some stuff about my friends, but they're super not cool. Oh, Sarah. Yeah. I do like her. It's just, um, she's never going to like me back. Well, yeah. not if you don't try, though, bud. Sorry, I know it must be disappointing knowing that your son's a loser. Oh. Harold, you're in high school, and everyone's a loser wow okay i like the supportiveness but he also basically just confirmed yeah i think you're a loser come around it's just it's not gonna happen overnight it's not gonna happen on any of us oh you can't think like that though harold harold there you go oh shit Ew. <laughs> I found him in the basement. What is that? The, the dummy. The dummy. His name's Slap. It's pretty cool, huh? Yeah, yeah, sure is. No denying that. Hi. No denying that. <laughs> how can everybody... Wow, that was I was gonna say, how can you just know how to do that? Because, I mean, has he done that before? I feel like you did the creeps. That almost frightened me to death. <laughs> I gotta go work on my technique. Gotta catch the bus. Oh, well, ho, hang on. You're taking that dog to school? Yes. Yeah. Um, maybe. I don't know if that's smart. Yeah. Scared for the day, bud. Work keeps your rage can't sleep. Yeah. For semester projects and theater classes, the performance arts teacher thought it might as well do something with Slappy. That could be kind of fun. Story. Remember church choir? You should sing. Or play guitar. Everyone loves guitar or. Literally anything else. Nobody else yeah. is going to do ventriloquism. I mean, that's exactly what we're afraid of. I mean, I love that he's trying to be different, but I can also see the parents' perspective where you're trying to kind of keep him understanding that some people are not going to be as open and understanding about those kinds of expression. Nobody can hear my friend. Trust me. Okay, next we have Harold. Yes, come on, Harold. Oh, the ventriloquist guy. Yes. Oh. It's different. It's fun. Oh, someone brought out a stool. Well, thank you. Okay. Oh, everybody! This is my friend Harold. Hi, everybody. Oh. <laughs> you suck. Dude, oh, shut that's up. What your mom said. <gasps> I didn't say that. Don't get this thing off my arm. It's stuck. Try having it up your ass. <laughs> That's not my voice. Th th this isn't funny. I think we can all agree on that. <laughs> Flappy's so much more brutal. I mean, I guess he's not more brutal, but he's definitely got a mouth on him. See, with me, you won't be a loser. Oh, shut up. What are you doing? Only one you can trust. Hey. 
There's something different about that girl. That was scary. I'd probably be running. Laura, what's up? Careful. I heard it talk. It's a ventriloquist yes. dummy. That's what it's supposed to be. No, no, Sarah. I heard it talk on its own. It came as it was alive. Sounds okay. Just take a deep breath. It's just um, a doll. No, I, I know what I heard. I'm not crazy. There's something about it. Okay, there's something evil about it. I don't know how oh, to say. see. You can't. You, you seem to have gotten to know Sarah pretty well. We think it'd be a good idea if you spent more time, you know, with your new real friends. <sighs> this isn't gonna go Tell well. Me. They weren't my real friends until the last week. I understand that now. That's I true. We'll still be there without the doll. Flappy, his name is Flappy Wet. <gasps> hey, God, oh, not ninja, you Harold. Speak to your mother that way. I hate you. Oh, Harold. Told her been different since we found it. He's been sleeping. Well, yeah, why do we have it in? Close to the fire. Didn't Why do we have it laying in the fire if we're not even sure we want to do this yet? Good. He can't go through what he went through last year. It'll break him. It's already in the fire, you guys. Burning. I see that. I just don't understand it. I mean, it's made of wood. How is it not burning? <gasps> what are you doing? Harold. You're killing him! It's a doll, Harold. No, you are a doll! He's not yet! Twisted Series for the best! He is what's best for me! It's time Harold! For Use the spell. No, Harold, no. Adana. No, Harold. Sonara Kudash. Adana. Mean Sonara. What's happening? Kudash. No. I don't like that. They were parents were so nice. They were just trying to look out for him. He killed his parents. Thank you, ladies. Thank you. <sighs> Harold Biddle and his dummy Flappy. Well, would you look at this? I'm back plumbing it at another high school gig. Not that I'm against school. Happen to be very educated. Can you give us an example, Flappy? Do you know the world's fastest land animal? The a answer cheetah? is Eliza Essex. When she fled the scene after nailing the principal's Oldsmobile in the parking lot last week. Oh my god. Ah, there's Ben Howard. Fort Lawrence's star quarterback. Yeah, oh my gosh, dude. Off, He's gonna sass Mr. them all. Sloppier kisser, Sarah. Your golden retriever or Ben? Ben. What the Victoria thinking people are still buying the virgin axe. Wow! Trying to hide the fact that she is still a virgin. God! Quite this is not funny. That was not okay. What the hell, Harold? What's your secret? Then why did you tell me? Really, Sarah? I trusted you. I'm pretty sure I am a virgin. Maybe you shouldn't have trusted her. You know those things that can't be your friends anymore, right? Yeah, Harold. Being nice to me just made you feel good about yourself. Why would you say that? You told me he was killed in your name of hope. What happened? I just didn't understand it yet. Understand what? The plan they gave me to make things. Harold, you're giving up your life with. I mean, I know that you think that they were just your friends because they were using you, but like. This is all your fault, Sarah. What the hell? Stop it. Okay, I saw it talk on its own. I'm telling you guys, we're in serious danger. Ever since we found the dummy, he changed. He told me he was scared. Yeah, because it's evil. And they went to collect the dummy to get rid of it, Look, but in turn they people, but I do know set his house on fire and killed him. So, let's do it. Yeah, let's get that dummy. Hello? Oh my gosh. Goodbye, little idiot. Goodbye to you, little idiot. Oh my god! <gasps> Shit! Oh, that was not them. That was the rumbling of the house. Put him in the box and lock it. We can't leave yet. We gotta help Harold. Harold! Oh, really? They just scared him. So it was an accident. Guys, open the fucking door. Why aren't we just opening the fucking door? Why aren't we banging on it? 
Oh, because he locked it from the other side, maybe? This all kind of happened because they were trying to help, but... Okay. I told you! You didn't believe me. Now what? Do we call someone? No. Billy's dead, okay? Doesn't even matter. What do I do? I, I can't go to jail. Okay, grab the cape! What did you do with him? Oh, yep. Did he get out? Oh damn, he put his head off. Oh my god. So our parents went in to get the puppet. Because, because it was evil. evil. Yeah, like Holy Valley. Yeah. Right? Yeah, and that's that's really good because it means they're not like real murderers, <laughs> which is great. But um he did die. Yes, they were actually real murderers. That's that's the whole point of the story. You <laughs> killed your parents for the evil one. Which is why Biddle's ghost is is here talking to us he's making me want to kill my yes. family and having Lucas listen to worms and leaving James for dead okay we get it thank you okay, okay yeah but this how Biddle's kid seems kind of like messed up and like our parents were probably trying to help him and well, most of our parents were were you even listening like I spell it out for you that's him yeah Talking to Biddle. Mr. Brett? What? It's not him. How do you know all of this? <laughs> right. Yeah, I was gonna say, it feels like we're asking that a little late. I know all this because I'm not Mr. Brat. Yeah, surprise! I'm Harold Biddle. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for this continuation. I feel like we're really getting into the deep about it though now. Like we're really starting to figure things out that they didn't. They bullied him constantly. They bullied him and bullied him and bullied him and then they broke into his house and they stole his best friend. Yes. Yes, his best friend. And they ended up killing him in the process. And this is where we find out who we've been talking to. Know all this because I'm not Mr. Brat. Surprise! I'm Harold Biddle, and it's time to get Slappy back. Okay, so how? Brat's on. Hey, Biddle's gone. Yeah, Biddle. Uh, door, 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 Oh damn, they did it. <gasps> There's a void. Okay, well that's not good. That's not good. Um, why are we not in the world anymore? Why is there a void outside our door? I don't know. We're gonna find out, I guess. Oh my gosh. How deep does that go? <gasps> Ew! That's... They're really trapped in the scrapbook. Okay. I'm gonna try the basement. No. Isaiah. Hello. Okay, so Biddle must have drawn a picture of us in the scrapbook to trap us here. Mm-hmm. How fast can he freaking do? We're all the same age. Look, my mom will realize I'm gone and she'll start freaking out seeing us. Oh, she's right. Our parents are gonna figure this out. We this can't just sit around and wait. Here on ice, brother. I'm sure they'll be here in a minute. Oh, she's not been taking them. Your parents should feel a lot more cool about now. Mm-hmm. Fuzzy and squeaky all the time. You know anything about that? Drowsiness is a common side effect of many medications. Getting the dosage right is key. You drugged me, Victoria. Yes. You were agitated and upset, and we didn't want you doing anything. You regret it. It was for your own right. good. Right. Oh. 
No, I don't know. I should. Well, maybe I should have a quick conversation with my lawyer. Yeah. Or the state medical board. You know. I would. Tell my own good. You're a listener, Big Tree. How about the two get carried away, Victoria? You know, <laughs> there's a ghost coming after our children. And you don't care. Is now good a good time to get a little carried away? I don't know when it is. What are you doing? She has it. Why the fuck do you have it? Nora, what, what are you doing? Oh my god, my phone. I was just checking your mail. I heard a noise. She went back to the mine and got it and brought it here. Wait, did you get discharged? You didn't call me? Yeah, no. Um, it happened so fast. I'm sorry. What's that mean? Why would I pick you up? No. Um, there's just there's a lot going on. Lucas? I was yes. thinking when you got out, we could celebrate or whatever is appropriate. Lucas I'm hasn't been home. You could get a couple Neither has your daughter. Some weird that guys, I'm so excited to see you. you I'll be more open. A dummy. No, wait. Look, I'm taking care of your kid and your fig tree, and you can't tell me what you're doing with that duffel bag. That's not how relationships work. Okay, I'm sorry, I can't. Oh, oh my gosh. I'm okay with that. I literally just went through this with Sarah. My marriage broke up because of a secret. Colin, everybody has secrets. No, they don't. I have zero secrets. You're the only That's kind of a lie, I've but... I've my whole life. You're going. Fine, go. But don't come back until you're ready to talk. Gosh. This poor guy is really getting the brunt of it, though, because every relationship, he's just not getting any communication and answers, and I... I know that they have reasons, but damn, he cannot be happy. Um, we, yeah, we can't just sit around. Just thought that maybe our parents will turn to us. Yes. Um, but in the meantime, I think we have to do something other than, other than just sit here and, and do I nothing. Thought, I don't know, just like explore this whole thing, this world, I don't know. You do realize we've come here exploring our own limits, right? Okay. Our James. Are you saying that this is my fault? No. No. It is. Mm -hmm. Okay, we got we to take a moment and just air all the grievances between everybody so that we can move the fuck on. Because we have too many, too much baggage going on in this room. Too many tensions. Somebody would land. My boat would be there. Just come on. Holy shit. What? We came in to get her. Okay, now I'm trapped in a scrapbook after being trapped in a mine, after being trapped in a house, by a cuckoo clock. And after being trapped in a house. Bring my parents with me. And they're the ones that made this ghost want to seek revenge on us for the sins of our parents, not Margaret. Thank you. But but we did start a nonprofit. It's called the Shadow Project. Okay, well, I think we're I'm back trying to be fair to my Backtrack. Backtrack. Of course. Me? Homies. What? What say that again? Say it. Homies. Both before homies. You got this so tight and I respect that. Mm. Oh, Lucas. Hey. Lucas. Can't come to the phone. Hi, honey, it's Mon. Listen, I'm sorry I didn't tell you I was getting out. There's just something I need to take care of. I'll call you when I'm on my way back home. I love you. I really don't want Nora to die. Is she gonna... I mean, she can't die, right? I feel like they're not actually gonna kill off a character in Goosebumps. Like... So who is this freaking weirdo following her? This just one... Hide behind each other, I guess. Or the Should couch. Hide and we go on three. On, on three or, or on go. I feel like we go. split up. Just kill it. Can we do it like a five more? Three, three, two, three, one. Who's that? Good. Oh, that's him. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. This is the real guy. That's the real guy. What? I'm the real brat. Brad's brat, not little brat. I'm me. I'm. He's the real brat, yeah. <laughs> I go, okay, wait, wait. This is going to sound crazy. I think I was I was asked to help them. Yes. What? And you have I been for quite some time. Did I know? So I, I okay, okay, so I was I was here doing a crossword puzzle and mm -hmm. kicking it, you know, and I see this thing and it comes rushing at me and it's right. flannel and body odor and before I knew it I was stuck here and that thing was me down there or whatever. Yes. Does that make sense? Yes. Given all that we know, yes. Little more than that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. okay, fair enough. I'll tell you. Uh, about Sarah? Nora. Sarah. Right? Yeah. No, it's uh, all out in the open. You know, 
Theron knows about him. He's close to the group. Okay. But you guys have known each other forever, right? She's a curse. Kathy, you know what's up. She got out. I thought she was down with me, but she's back in a weird way. Not her normal way. Did he know specifics? Oh, yeah. He got in this big fight. And she won't talk to him. And she keeps... She just said she had to go secrets. take care of something. Sonny's one that There's a lot. Like, just tell me, man. I, is there like a repressed memory? There's a lot you don't she know. That she's unlocked. This is dumb. Did you guys run over a doll in high school or something? Okay. Interesting. There's like a duffel bag that she has that has some doll parts in it that's in the shed. Right. How long have you been here? A long time. I'd have to say time is is a blur. Um, it's the night of your entry. That was a long time ago. It was. That was a long time ago. Hungry? Okay. No, like I said, I've mostly just been preoccupied with really extreme existential dread. Yes. And of course, trying in vain to get out of this weird purgatory, purgatory house. Yeah. Which I'll save you the trouble. <laughs> there is no exit. Okay. There has to be a way. Yeah. Uh, that's what I thought when I first got here. I was like, okay, I'm sorry to be the bearer of bad news. There's none. But We're gonna kick uh, ass. Uh, well, let's some tactics like we do in class. Yeah. Um, so let's start with what we know. What do we know? What do we, okay, what do we, know? we know? We know that. Um, we know that Biddle. Uh, well, y well, we know that you guys are here because Biddle put you in the scrapbook. Yeah. And mm -hmm. that I'm here because Biddle took control of my body. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. So he must be. He must be trapped in his mind. Yeah, my, it makes sense. I, I like, like that. And if that's the case, then well, what do we, I don't know. Do? All we have to do is go get in his mind. In kind of a wrecking situation. You're the adult in your own. Well, I got us started, Margo. I can't. I was do gonna say he can't do everything. Minds. I'm aging. I'm, 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 I'm degrading. I'm aging. There's gotta be a way out, right? Simple as that. Yes. Okay. Good, Isaiah. I agree with Isaiah. Grab on. Okay. Got it? Yeah. One quick pull means that I'm fine. Okay? And two quick pulls means yank me up. Okay, yeah, but like what happens if there's no pull? Great question. Okay, so I, I like the plan. Hey, hey. I, like I was going to say, I don't. Walk on through the good night. Can I have some slack? I need to sit. Help her out, okay? Okay. Why? These are all the people. Ew. Bro, we didn't investigate very much. Pull it twice. I said, hey, she pulled twice, split up! We didn't investigate very much. Is he back? This looks kind of like the place James was caught up in. <gasps> James. Duplicate James. <gasps> James? No. What the hell are you doing there? Did your mom tell you about this? She's not my mom. 
But I'm gonna deal with her as soon as I'm done with you. What are you doing? <gasps> Fuck! What? James? Mm-mm. That's not James. Is this where you've been spending the night? With your friends? You've been turning the family mind into a drug den? Huh. Look who's projecting. I think we both know your son's not the one with the problem here, Eliza. <gasps> Why are you talking like that? Because it's time to stop numbing the pain and live in the real world. <laughs> what are you doing? You better you kick really this little boy's you ass. For what you did to Harold? Dude, girl, kick his ass. No, he's not James. Kick his ass. This boy is younger than you, or smaller than you. Kick his ass. Yeah! Uh, pain makes me go back into my body. Yeah! Turn into my real body. Are you serious? Yes, I'm serious. I, I was I was in my car and um, I saw everything. The, the, the scrapbook. Wait, you saw the scrapbook? Yeah, yeah just, just right there, sitting on the seat next to me. Okay, that is how we're getting out of here. What? What? what, what okay, so we hit him. Mr. Bratt can get the scrapbook and he can write us a way out. Oh. Mm -hmm. Yes. Actually, you know what? Um, not to brag, but I I am a bit of a writer. Okay. Yes, cool. I, um, mm -hmm. Had a few short stories published in Horror Weekly. You want to see any of those? Okay. That's so great. cool. Um, so okay. What you're gonna so. Have to do is you're gonna uh, write a way out, uh, an exit out of this page. That's yes. So go ahead and hit him, yes. and then we'll do it again. And in order to do that, um, we're, we're gonna need to send you back. This has been a long drive. Where have you been going? Biddle's following close behind. What's she doing? Why is she just stretching? Does it have to be her? Oh, don't worry. Her bark is worse than her bite. Her, her bite was pretty bad last time. Yeah, oh my gosh. She's trying to kill me, you know? For real? Yeah, but are you, are you serious? Your mom. And she, it's really your your brother and Lucas. I guess you with the oar. I mean, she is a badass. Is it cool about the Nathan of it yeah, all? Yeah, I don't uh, like, I like it. Remind you that I am still technically your teacher. So okay. when we do go back to the real world, I will still be your teacher and sure. I'm gonna confuse the other students. So I'd appreciate it if you go back to call me just Mr. Brown. Oh, oh my ah. God! She did it so hard. Okay, be quick about it. Don't dick a dick around. Like, come on. What are you doing? Nora! Hey! It's... It's Nate! Nora, it's Nathan! Scratch! Why are you not writing in the book? Nora! Hey! Um, it's... It's Nathan! What the hell? What is that? What are you doing? Oh. Ooh, okay, um, did you see the scrapbook? Yeah, it's <laughs> right there, right on this passage. You gotta get us out of here. I will, just give me, give me a second. Oh my god! He just did it again. Come on! You don't have to hit so hard! You <laughs> don't have to hit so hard! Hey, hear me. Thank you, Lucas. Okay, for the love okay. of all that is good, write okay. in that book, please. What is he hiding? What is in the book? Stop it. Let him oh, read. No. Hey. Let him read. Fiddle. <gasps> oh my gosh, you guys. What do we do? Guys, what's going on? It's dissolving. The world around us is ceasing to exist. Oh, I 
hate that. I want to see what happens next. All right, that was fun. All right, so that was episodes five, six, and seven. Another couple good episodes. I I feel like these ones probably weren't as strong as the first few, only because I'm not feeling really quite the goosebump goosebumps likeness to it. It's more of a whole other series of events I feel like going on. And like it seems like it feels like a different series. It doesn't really feel goosebumps like the other ones did. Like with the haunted mask, it doesn't feel kind of like eerie and kind of like fun like that one did. Or I don't know. I'm really kind of upset because I feel like I wanted more of Slappy. Like, especially with the episode being Night of the Living Dummy, I feel like I wanted to see Slappy more. But they kind of like kept him as a background as far as the story. I mean, in that episode, he was present a lot, but like, we didn't really get to see him do very much. I mean, other than just be a maniacal little dummy partner to people, we didn't actually see him wreak havoc on his own or anything. We didn't actually see any of that. So that was kind of disappointing. I'm hoping that he comes back and maybe wreaks some havoc on his own because I feel like the episode that I was waiting for was the Slappy-centered episode and all we got was Slappy, but we got a backstory and he just ended up helping people get to fame or popularity and then and then he didn't do anything else with it. So I'm really curious where this is going. Um, we only have three episodes left. We have eight, nine, and ten. And then we are done with the series, you guys. I hope you're enjoying it. Um, I am enjoying it. Like I said, I don't know if I'm enjoying it as much as I would if they would incorporate more Goosebumps feel to it instead of just like a drama feel to it. Because um, it just feels like a teen drama, like a, a different, it doesn't feel like Goosebumps. It doesn't feel like I'm watching Goosebumps is the problem. We're saying Goosebumps, we're having the same characters as Goosebumps, but it doesn't feel like a Goosebumps episode. So I don't know how to make it feel that way, but it just doesn't feel, have that feeling to me about, it doesn't feel like that to me. And um, like I said, three episodes to go. So I'm excited. I'm curious where this is going to end. We've come through a long journey. So look forward to the next binge um, video that we're going to do. And I have a lot more spooky content coming your way. So keep watching the spooky content this month. I hope you guys are enjoying and thank you so much for watching. And if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like on the video. But thank you so much for watching. Thank you for staying awesome. And until next time, guys, stay spooky.